This video is all about to show you how to perform a bare metal restore with Veeam Agent and have a working computer. This is a three-step process and an excellent way to have your computer ready with all the software and settings installed, or transfer it to another computer. For step one we need to have a working backup. Since we already have one, we are going to use it for this demonstration. Now, assuming that you have a working backup stored somewhere, you need to use the Veeam Recovery Media tool to create a bootable USB drive. To access the tool, find the wizard from the Start menu. For demonstration purposes we are going to use the default settings and continue. Select the location where the ISO file will be stored and provide any necessary credentials to access that location. Now just wait for the ISO file to be completed. The next thing we have to do is to create a bootable USB drive. There are a lot of options out there. We will use Rufus for this demo which we have already downloaded. This process is so easy to complete as 1, 2, 3. First attach your USB drive. Second select the ISO you want to use and finally press start. Now that the process is completed, restart your PC and boot from the USB drive. The software will be loaded in order to start the recovery process. Select the bare metal recovery option. Choose the location of your backup. In our case we select the network storage option. Click on the shared folder, and configure any network settings if needed. When prompted, connect to the backup storage location containing the Veeam backup files and provide any necessary credentials to access the backup repository. Select the restore point you need. Your computer will be restored back to that exact point. For this demonstration we will use the entire computer option. Click the restore button to initiate the process. The duration of the restoration process will vary depending on the amount of data being restored. Now, click finish and restart the computer. Thank you very much for watching. Let us know in the comments below, about your thoughts on this video. Interested in watching more tech videos? Stay tuned!